life. What is life? What the fuck is your life? Are you happy with it? And if so, is just the intake and outtake of breath that makes you put a smile on your face? That's something your fucking mother gave you. You even earned that. What have you done with your life to make it something else besides the normality of everybody else? The intake and the outtake of what you call life is nothing more than time. And unless done something with, it's forgotten about. There's no footprint of your existence left for anyone else to follow. Life is time. And a life that's remembered, where a footprint is followed behind in footsteps of inspiration and motivation, is when time is met with opportunity and action. They collide to be a life of remembrance. The problem is, most people don't have a plan. And without a plan of your own life, you become the plan of someone else's life. You're not running the day, the day's running you. The differential between those people is belief. One person with belief overrides a hundred people with just intent. Intent is thought process, thinking, wargaming it, never putting a foot forward, never putting their, their face or their name to the fire. Belief is going after and figuring it out along the way. This workout is going to bring that belief back in your life. It's a back workout. And after this workout, not only will you have a stronger back, you have belief and confidence put into action. Life. No longer is your life filled with stop signs and yield signs and halts and this shit and, and fucking unauthorized motherfucking signs. Life begins now. If it doesn't begin now, your life is fucking over. Welcome to the Chamber of Belief, aka the motherfucking gym. If you guys don't start believing in yourselves, your life will be nothing for anyone to ever follow or want. You have to believe what you're doing is making a difference. Because it fucking is. What I love about this, guys, is the middle of the set. It's like the journey of your life. Like you're born, you lift the weight up. It feels light at first. And as you keep going, it gets harder and harder and harder. So what happens is your physical strength has left the building. The only thing left to override the differential of continuing the journey or stopping the journey is the mental strength. And you start to develop that. And mentally, you have a number in your head you're going for. Even though your body's physically hit failure, you keep pushing past mentally three more and when you finish it you're like god damn man I'm so glad I believed in myself I'm so glad I didn't sell myself short because at the end of the day if you don't believe in yourself who can you ever expect to you guys must be be the now of what you want to be later it starts right now and if you're not doing the now don't ever expect the later to be the person you want to look in the mirror Everyone's like, oh, later in life, I want to do this. Later in life, I want to do that. Later in life is turning around, looking in the mirror right now. That's the later in life. And unless that turnaround is something in progression, later in life ain't going to be anything different. Belief, when you turn around, you're going to see something that put a smile on your face. It's going to make you turn around the next day for action. Turn belief into productivity. Otherwise, why are you in here, man? You in here to grow what? What the fuck are you in here for? Think, guys. Think of where you want to be before you start where it is now. It's too hard, man. The journey's too fucking hard. You guys start trying to follow someone else's path to success. You guys are dazed and confused. You must travel your individual path success. Someone else's path's already been done. It's time for you to incorporate what you believe in. Make your own fucking path. Huh. Well, that's the workout, guys. I'm fucking exhausted right now. Oh.
and I feel like shit, worn out, no energy. I can't wait to go to sleep. Seriously, I really feel like my heart's gonna explode right now. It's not a comfortable feeling at all. I'll tell you what, the feeling I feel right now, as bad as it feels, is a fucking hell of a lot better of a feeling than a life where you throw the towel in. That's something you never recover from. Tomorrow morning, I'll wake up stronger. I'll feel alive. And I'll have the belief and confidence backing me up. After a good night's rest, I can only get better. When the towel's down in life, there is no, there's no more rounds, man. You threw it in. I feel like shit right now, but I can pick the towel back up. I'm gonna be stronger tomorrow the next round. Life, guys, is the plan of action. If you don't have the plan, I guarantee you someone's gonna use you as part of their fucking plan. Stop fucking going about the day as a servant. Become the master. Run your day and stop having it run you. Believe in yourself. Be that one of a hundred that has a belief instead of just fucking jaw jet talk of intent. Huge differential there. Differential of somebody just breathing life and the other one taking the most of the opportunity of time of life. Remembrance. Otherwise, forgotten. Greg Plitt, help me stay fit. I'm so fucking tired, I forgot a backpack on. Uh. <laughs> uh, Greg Plitt, we putting the shirt on. Still though, both times, helping you stay fit. Have a good night. Wake up stronger. Enjoy life.